Hey, it's just a reading here. Today is March 27, 2023. The time is 3.44 a.m. You already know I'm finna get into a Capricorn reading. New clean reading for you. No projection. Only my angels and ancestors are welcome. Let's get into it. Clear understanding, truthful understanding. Let's go ahead and break the deck down the middle. If I get to sneezing, y'all already know my allergies be tripping. I did take my uh, allergy medication already. If you are new, welcome. If you've been here, you already know the drill. Gonna tap into y'all energy. If it resonated, resonated. If it don't, it don't. I don't know how this region is gonna go, but we gonna find out. For Capricorn, March twenty seventh, and your first card is the Queen of Pentacles. Next card is the Four of Pentacles and the Four of Cups. Ooh. You a little mad here. The sun is here. Let me move this up. So you can see the cards. Oh, look at that little baby. <laughs> that baby is so good. I love these cards. They're so funny. Tell me more. Right here with the cherry is something finna be moving fast. Cancer energy. Right here with the emperor. With the eight of cups, leaving something behind. And at the bottom, the seven of wands, ready for battle. Your ass is defensive, okay? Tell me about this queen of pentacles. Somebody that's grounded, got their money together. Right here with the Ten of Cups and the Knight of Cups. So, um, family, marriage, somebody who's romantic, sensitive, following their heart. Is that what you want right now? Tell me more about this Knight of Cups. With the Ace of Cups. Yeah, new love here. It could be somebody here trying to offer you some new love. Or you could be on this type of uh, wave right now where you want to offer somebody some type of love. Ten of Cups is here. Not of Cups is here. So, some uh, emotional awakening here. Love is here. So, this Queen of Pentacles energy, but the Four of Pentacles here. Hmm. Who's greedy and who's holding on to their money? Is this you? The Knight of Swords, yeah. Authority, somebody who's um, logical. <laughs> yeah. This could be very well you. Probably don't want no love, worrying about your money right now, or what you feel. Tell me more about this King of Swords. Is this you? With death, a new beginning. <laughs> Letting go of something or some type of um, new cycle, a uh, new beginning. Tell me more right here with this devil card at the bottom. So something was toxic, addiction. Tell me more about this death card. Right here with that. Uh, no, all four of those came out. Nope, only take it if it's two. If it's more than like two cards that fall out, I don't take them. Like put them back in the deck and reshuffle. The Six of Swords, yeah, you moving away from something. You're like, nope, it doesn't suit me anymore. So something is dead and gone, honey. And uh, you're moving away. It's a relief. Better days are coming with this Four of Pentacles. So if it got something to do with your money, that's finna end. I see y'all might be in a little tight situation with your money. Yeah, right here, skeptical with this uh, Four of Cups. <laughs> Maybe thinking negative about something. Y'all seem a little mad. Let me see. What y'all mad about? Four of Cups. Go ahead and tell me it's not for everybody, though. I'm not saying everybody's mad. 
Okay, so justice is here. Some type of truth is going to come out. Maybe that's why you don't want that card. Tell me more about justice, please. I'm sorry if I jump right into these readings. I'm not like other tarot um, card readers. I don't be taking forever. I'll be jumping right into it, okay? I'm sorry, Vaughn. <laughs> I just want to get y'all energy. Tell me more about justice. With the Wheel of Fortune, yeah, change. Something to change for you. It's something that's going on with the red and blue, you know, the po po. <laughs> The justice system, look, it's finna change. Something's finna come in. So if y'all, you know, got some, got into trouble, had a ticket or something like that, it's it's finna go in your favor, right? So you got good luck here. Some of y'all. The hermit. So you may be um trying to search for the truth. I feel like some of y'all got in trouble. Not even gonna lie. <laughs> So you might be like ducked off right now. Don't want to be bothered. Turned down. You feel me? I, I get it. But um, guidance is here for you. The truth is here. So you got to meditate. Breathe in. Breathe out. All right. So maybe being by yourself is good because the sun is here. It's going to be some type of joy, positivity, celebration. So let's talk about the sun card. I love seeing the sun card pure happiness all right with the queen of swords so you're gonna have to protect yourself be honest tell me more about the queen of swords with the eight of swords in reverse yeah you need to release something you may be um scared i'm getting a strong energy that some of y'all got into trouble <laughs> I'm just saying. Tell you more about this eight of swords. It's not funny. I got in trouble before too, so I can't talk shit. Tell me more about this uh eight of swords. With the two of wands, you got a decision to make. So if you plan on traveling, um if I were you, I would wait first until you get out of this um eight of swords in reverse, okay? So you need to face your fears. You need to find the truth, be honest, protect yourself, and get that freedom so you can go ahead and make those wise decisions you need to make with this two of wands so you can plan for the future, okay? But you need to get yourself out of that eight of swords first. Tell me more about the cherry. This is a fast card. So something's going to get ready and move fast for you. You have the control over it. You have that confidence. With the Ace of Swords. Yeah, this is going to be a breakthrough for you. So whatever's going on with you right now is going to be a breakthrough. Tell me more about the Ace of Swords. Capricorn, male or female. Tell me more about the Ace of Swords for them. The Fool. So yeah. You're going to probably have to be ready for this adventure. Maybe just go ahead and take a risk with it. The full card is here. Aries energy. Tell me more about the full. Yeah, with this Knight of Wands. Be confident about it. So yeah, the Ace of Swords is here. It's going to be some type of truth. New ideas. New beginnings. So new, new, new everything. All right. Um, and the fool is here. So take that adventure. Be confident, energetic. You know, you be straight right here with the emperor. You have that structure and that authority. You have the last say. Tell me more about the emperor with the tower. So you, um, something maybe have to end to get better right here. So this probably ending. So may got something to do with your pride too. Tell me more about this tower. Trying to break a cycle right here with strength in the three of swords. So, yeah, if you're feeling depressed, um, not really feeling well, it's going in right here, both with this tower. 
Taurus here with this Three of Swords. Like I said, it's going to be a release from you because strength is here. You got to stay focused, though. Right here with the Eight of Cups. So what are you walking away from? I feel like whatever you're walking away from, you're okay with it. I don't see you not being okay with it. The Ten of Pentacles. You're going to be walking away from your once family. But why? This Ten of Pentacles. Because it was a lot of chaos and arguments right here with this Five of Wands. Tell me more about this Five of Wands. What used to be is not there no more. Not getting along, not seeing eye to eye. Yep, the Two of Swords, you're stuck in the middle, though, about it. So if you're thinking about leaving this Ten of Pentacles, it's not a Ten of Pentacles anymore if the Five of Wands is here. And it, and it and it might even still be a Ten of Pentacles. This, the money could still be very good, but there's a lot of aggression and a lot of high tension around and you're debating if you want to stay in this right here with this avoiding <coughs> i'm so sorry capricorn oh my god with this tough decision making right here you're blind so you got your blindfold on too like i don't see shit but may need to take it off make that decision but you ready for whatever right here with the seven of wands you're like i can't take this shit no more let me stop <laughs> tell me more about the seven of wands why are you so guarded assertive ready to fight <laughs> queen of wands hmm Who's this Queen of Wands? The Ace of Pentacles. Okay, so this is you. Tell me more about that. Uh, well, the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Did you lose your job? Oh, hell no. <laughs> Let me stop. Is that why you're... You're ready to go to war right here. You lost your job. Because this page of pentacles in reverse is somebody that lost their job. It's not for everybody, okay? Money could be a little funny right now with you and somebody else with this ten of pentacles. Or this could just be, you know, at work, conflict with people at work. And money is, is looking a little funny. You may have left your job or want... To get another job and you're in the middle with this two of swords. You're very independent and confident so you can do it. There's a business opportunity here. So you may have to just go ahead and um, leave something behind to get to somewhere better. And if it already happened. Yeah, maybe that's why you mad right now. I want to... Confirm this page of pentacles by myself. And I want to talk about this two of swords. So let's go ahead. Let me make sure there's no other cards in reverse here. I feel like you got a lot going on when it comes down to trying to, you know, handle your business work-wise. And I'm looking at this eight of swords. And there's a lot of people around, maybe a lot of people that need your help too with that, because the, they probably look at you as that Ten of Pentacles. You probably lost your job or money is low right now, so you probably want people to get the fuck out your face. And I don't blame you. People just need, 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 or want, want, want. And you probably so tired because you was in the Four of Pentacles too, holding on to your money. So you probably tired of giving money away. I feel like there's a lot of people that um, needs something from you. I feel like you walking away from that. Tell me about this Eight of Swords in reverse. 
You want your freedom. You want to break free. Tell me what you want to break free from. You want to release. You want your freedom back. I feel like you're tied to a lot of people. That's why I said. Seems like a lot of people are here that need you, need you. Always wanted something. Make sure these are not upside down. Hold on, y'all. I do not want to get you guys no a bunch of reversal cards if they're not supposed to be in reverse. Okay. Tell me about this um air source, please. See, judgment is here. So you're awakening from all this shit right here. You're breaking free. So whoever is all up in your energy needs your money, always looking at you as a a fucking walk-in bank account, it, it's finna end here because judgment is here. The truth is finna come out about these people that are around you that always need something from you. But I feel like you're very tense. Like, you know, and if the money isn't really coming in as good as it was with your job, how do people expect for you to take care of them? You know, so it's not, first off, you need to just reflect and just have that that spiritual awakening and and open your third eye and just have time for yourself. Honestly, this is not it right here, though. You need to break free. And I feel like you are going to break free right here with this two of swords. So what is you thinking about? What decision do you need to make, Capricorn? The Knight of Pentacles. Say, so, yeah, you're about to get rain. Protect your money. You're about to get rain. Be patient. Yup. That's what you're finna do. His money might be a little funny right now for you. It happens. You know, it is the end of the month. So, you know, bills do need to get paid <laughs> coming up. So, yeah, please focus on your money. Don't keep giving to a bunch of people that's not giving back. Tell me more about this page of Pentacles in reverse. Did you lose your job? Did you, you know, really have... A financial loss. Please be truthful. <laughs> yeah, but the King of Cups is here. You're very compassionate <coughs> and friendly. So this is going to change. Some more about this King of Cups. Yeah, but you need to heal. You've been this. You've been in this King of Cups energy. You've been helping too. Like I just, I was told you, I was getting that. You helping a lot of people. <laughs> May not even feeling good. Your health might not even be that good right now. There's just too much going on. But the star is here, Capricorn. It's time to rejuvenate yourself. Faith and hope is here. It's all finna get balanced out. <coughs> I feel y'all energy. You guys are tired, okay? I don't blame you. Everybody needs something. Everybody wants something. Like, what about me? Y'all got to put yourself first, too. I know y'all like to give. But it's time to receive. Go ahead and pull two angel cards for you, okay? Y'all going to be all right. <laughs> this ain't going to be for everybody. Might be a Capricorn. Like, that shit don't apply to me. I'm like, I bet. Because I've, I've heard some of my readings, too. I'm like, girl, ain't shit wrong with me. But, yeah, this is for somebody who needs to hear it, okay? <clears throat> for Capricorn, let's get you an angel card, all right? I'm about to get ready and knock out after this because I've been up all day cleaning. 
I'm getting ready for the next week, washing my clothes and everything. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and read this acceptance. See yourself and others through the eyes of the angels. With unconditional love and acceptance in this way, you inspire and lift everyone to their highest potential. See, you are the healer. You help people reach their expectations. <laughs> but you need to start accepting that you need to reach yours too. Let's go ahead and get you another card, okay? <clears throat> well, both of these came out, so we're going to get it, all right? <clears throat> no, in a year from now, okay? So a year from now, none of this is even going to even probably cross your mind and exist because you you going to start saying no to people, all right? <laughs> That's what y'all need to do. Say no. All right, Capricorn, I'm about to get ready. Knock out. <sighs> I did too much today, my damn self. I know this reading was a little short. Sometimes they're not going to always be long, okay? But until next time, Capricorn, please get you some sleep. Please rest. Save your money. Bye.